The normal mean is informally warranted against daily change or disuniformity. I'm not who I was. And neither are you, at least. I don't think you were ever me. Because then there'd be two of us the same, but we're not, we're different. I wear pants, you wear a dress. I'm pretty organized, your room's a mess. I write poems, you listen, are you listening? Because my armpits are glistening. <laughs> you probably wear deodorant. There, that moment. Though you're giving me your attention, all of it, I'm sure, your brain just probably had an epiphany. This guy's kind of awkward. <laughs> but if weird is defined by not normal, then everyone you know is a freak. Awkward. A strange designation like, because I'm not you, I get a citation. Well, I'm shocked you can write the ticket. Because people who don't have a brain usually only know how to take a pen and click it. Come on, man, just think. Normalcy is fallacy, a construction of the mind. Uniformity, a glaze, the average, a lie. Even the people you see as normal are miles apart in thinking. Man is defined by his strangeness and tweaking differences that you'll never identify with. If you hung out with you from last year, who would think who is the queer? Go ahead and have lunch together. Find out that your thoughts weren't forever. See the change in your endeavors. Find out that you weren't so clever. Ever changing, yet never failing to call anything other than the current version of you awkward. If they don't walk like me, treat like leprosy. Talking different equals mocking distance. Those with goofy laughs don't deserve you, O oh king of ha ha ha. <laughs> well, your laughter bores me. I'd rather hear a laugh with some snorting. I'd rather hang out with a guy who spills milk out his nose or the girl who squishes mud in her toes because she appreciates that this is the ground saying, ah, after a good rain. Even God isn't a fan of typical. Rather than cyclical, biblical means miracle. A word we use when predictable gets traded for mystical. The normal physical principle for the invincible atypical. Critical, pivotal truth displayed by destroying the statistical, explicable routine. Whimsical, unthinkables to toy with rabbinical, unoriginals. Analytical, cynical, hypocriticals enraged when the fallacy of normalcy slides out of reality, up their eyelids, and into the only place it can exist. The bowl of noodles they call a brain. <laughs> and just to protect their ideas of what is supposed to happen, they call Jesus demon-possessed, just to justify his arrest and killing God to protect their supposed shoes. Like setting fire to a Bugatti because it doesn't look like everyone else is super. I suppose you wouldn't do the same? Well, I did. And God is still taking this typical and is making me an original. I mean, uh, look at Peter. He talked way too much and he was basically Jesus' favoritist. Moses stuttered bunches and God made him a leader. Matthew had a bad habit of taking people's money. <laughs> Sarah was way too old to have kids. Jeremiah cried all the time. So go ahead. Join the kingdom of misfits. Pronounce words funny. Pay the cashier in pennies. Pick up the trash that guy just littered. Have a surprise wedding. Tip way too much. Put on both pant legs simultaneously. <laughs> know everything about something. Love when you're grumpy and serve when you're hungry. Hold something gross. Count your sneezes. Name your freckles. Steve. <laughs> Give a stranger an empty box. Drive on the wrong side of the road. No, 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 don't do that. Share Jesus with a grocery bagger. Go ahead. <laughs> I'm giving you permission. Be awkward. <laughs>